shaking like the crib dance mm. Who that at the front don't think that it's a crib man Pay that man and told him don't tip man mm. Back it out back, got my eyes on my dick man Now I won't go like the red man Ay, go, 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 go that my car is done and it's been done since actually about probably like eight months ago I'm trying to film some more stuff sadly I still live in the uh, the shithole state of Virginia I'm stuck here for another two two and a half years I think what can I say this fucking state sucks I absolutely hate it it's cold it's nothing like Florida I can't collab with Diego and John and all them in efforts trying to keep the channel alive I'm going to start recording again so y'all can have some content. Some Virginia shenanigans or what the fuck goes on in this shithole state. Because I absolutely hate it here. This state sucks. So, with my Subaru, it's got about, I think about, I want to say almost 15,000 on the block. Maybe, since I got it back in June. Yeah, I got it back in June when I came back from San Diego. As you can see, it's a very, uh, very shitty day outside. Not much I can really do today. Um, as far as the uh, rebuild on, on the Subaru, um, in total it cost me a little bit over $4,000. Uh, that's what, you know, with the help of friends and not taking it to a shop or anything. Uh, we got it back together when all the parts came back. Probably well, we got it together in, in a matter of two weeks, if that. So my buddy, he helped me out a lot on this. Or as far as you know, saving money and doing it at his place, and he's already had the experience of building two uh, two EJ motors, so he just he lent a, a great hand and to help uh, get my car back on the road. He actually kept working on it when I was in San Diego for a whole month. I mean, he didn't have to, but I'm greatly appreciate that he did work on it and continued to push this car so it can be back on the road. Also, if you checked out the last video, his car was down. His car is back up now, making. Uh, he's still on the tuning process of it, so right now he went on the dyno, he made about 3.30. But that was on a really shitty tune. So he's hoping that once he gets on corn and gets his final revisions in, he's pushing, I don't know, hope, he's hoping for like 400 horsepower. As far as plans, um, I don't plan anything out for, as far as, you know, video and content. I just kind of, if something interesting fucking grabs my attention, I'm going to pull out the camera and start recording. You know, it's just that. Unless there's like a really big thing that's coming up. Like, uh, I don't know any big meets coming up. It's way too cold to for us to be fucking standing with their dicks out in our hands at a meet gawking at other cars. Um, the big meets start up again around the springtime. So, yeah. So for now, I guess I'm just gonna be, it's like a, a day in the life of me, I guess. I don't know. If you think it's good, then get my